I'd like to demonstrate how to install the optional peeler. Part, this is part of Brother's future proofing options where you can add the peeler after deployment by simply removing a couple screws, plugging this in, make one setting, and you're ready to go. Let me demonstrate how easy it is to do. First, turn the printer over, get a flat blade screwdriver, and remove the first two screws on the, from the bottom cover. Then this piece comes off. Now you have to remove the front cover here. There's two, two more screws. Now, take your peeler, there's a connector. Plug in the connector first. Then there's these two nuts that have to be positioned underneath the previous mounts that you remove the screws from. Take the front cover, slide it from the top down, like so, and then put the remaining two screws. There you have it. First you start push the menu button, and the menu will scroll you to the different options, but you want to pick the one that says settings, hit OK. Then you want to scroll down to you see the setting for exit position, hit OK. Two options, a terror bar or peeler. I want to do the peeler. Move it down one, OK. Menu back, and you're, you're all set. Now that you installed the peeler, let me show you how to load the peeler. So first, I'll start by opening the top cover. Load the media as normal. You have to open the peeler with this little button here. Take the media, and you have to feed the free end of the labels through the exit slot on the bottom as so, and you have to advance it till the gap is right at the metal uh, separation bar. Hold in place, close the peeler door, drop the media in the media guides, close the lid, and if you wanna start a job, and you're ready to go. Pull down the liner, and you can just take the label and apply it.